Hi everyone, it's me, Mother Sparkle. Hey guys, so it's post Pride and I'm a little bit depressed, not gonna lie, because all the fun activities is now all long gone. So now it's like back to real life, you know, there's not that much crazy parties anymore, which is a little bit depressing. <laughs> Um, but I had so much fun at Pride this year in Vancouver 2017 with Fido. Thank you so much, Fido, for reaching out to me and hooking me up and my friends with some media and VIP passes. We went to some behind the scenes stuff and enjoyed some pretty cool exclusive activities. It was super fun. The first day of Pride, which was the block party, we went to the silent disco, okay, that was in front of 1191 Fido, and it was super fun. I've never been to a silent disco before, so I didn't really know what to expect. I had to Google it, I'm not gonna lie, but um, people, like, you wear headphones in on and then you like listen to music so if you don't have headphones you just see a bunch of people dancing with no music so it's pretty pretty funny um i was celebrating with some of my closest friends and we had a good good time here's a little short clip we're on this island just go right now we can't hear anything Yeah, the silent disco was super fun the next day we went to the what did we do the next day pool party like literally my weekend was so turned that i i have a loss of memory <laughs> <laughs> We went out to another party at night time but sunday was so much fun we went to a vip brunch that fido set up for us which is super super nice down by the boat house and then i met up with the fido float and the fido parade <laughs> so much fun to see everyone so happy and celebrating pride um vancouver is really nice for pride because you see people from all walks of life you see little children you see you know older people and it's just so amazing to see everyone come together in one place and just celebrate pride and be proud oh and not to mention i was on breakfast television here in vancouver which is kind of like a big deal so i was really nervous like you know when you rehearse something over and over in your mind you tend to screw up and that's exactly what happened to me so yes i stumbled a little bit i'm so sorry Fido but here's a little behind the scenes of the breakfast television so the theme of this year's pride is what is your pride so Julie what is your pride my pride is you know I'm motivated to be on this path and be on this journey um, inspiring other people not only am I a transgender person but um, I'm an older sister to my siblings and to a lot of my followers out there so that just inspires me and I'm so proud of who I am that's amazing. So it's such a pleasure. I was looking forward to yes, this interview course. with you all week. Julie Vu, I know you don't want to be called a, tra a, a, a YouTube star, <laughs> no. but you are, you are, and you're thank doing you. wonderful things for the community. So thank you for being in Vancouver for, for Vancouver me. Pride. So after the Pride Parade, I was at the Fido Go-Getters Hub, which is really cool. Um, there was like Fido Jenga. You could write cute messages and put them on the wall. There was like a charging station, and it was just a really good time. I had a meet and greet from 3.30 to 4.30. I met a lot of my supporters, which is super, super nice. I was a little bit hot. I was sweaty. I do apologize. But one of my supporters came from Seattle, and they came and gave me this book, which I'm so, so happy. Thank you so much, Gan. Um, I really appreciate it because I do follow, like, all these quotes and stuff on Instagram. It's, like, one of my favorite pastime hobbies. So um, really, really cute, cute quotes. Yes relatable hashtag love so yeah thank you so much for the book i really do enjoy this i don't know if you guys follow Fido mobile on instagram or their social media accounts but i did take over their instagram story from four to six and it was so crazy because hello like i got into like a like a corporate company's like instagram story and i was like oh my gosh this is so cool so i took over i did like a few no i did like six or seven stories so if you guys follow Fido mobile you've probably seen me take over which is really cool and then I do have a cool little video coming up with you guys. Um, collaborated with Fido. It's going to be Pride related and I can't wait for it to be released so I can show you guys. So stay tuned for that. It is coming right up with Vice and Fido. Super, super exciting. Um, but yes, I had an amazing Pride. I hope you did as well. Once again, shout out to Fido Mobile. Thank you so much for being an official partner for the Pride festival across Canada, Montreal, Toronto, and Vancouver. You the best. Thank you so much for inviting me along this amazing journey. Um, I can't wait to see you next year. Mwah.